Well, at this Walmart, they don't discourage overnight parking anywhere. All right, Taos Library. Very busy. I kind of think I can make it though, so I'm gonna I'm gonna try this intersection that does not have the stoplights. It says it's an option to take a left, so it looks like there's some pretty good brakes. Oh god. Okay. And I can also just get into the center median. Oh my god. Mmm, that dude is speeding. Oh my god, everybody's speeding. Oh, I think I can make it. Oh. Center median. I can't really see too well. Looks okay. Okay, we got. Oh, I turned the volume down. That's right. Yeah, I didn't get anything at that Walmart. I just didn't see any. It's, it doesn't really look. It doesn't have much. I think there's some grocery stores up ahead somewhere. Okay, I got 1.2 miles. And there we go. So what, 40 miles an hour? Albertsons, yeah, that'd be nice. It's a mile away from the, the library. I think it's a well, Smith's not far from the library, but they don't they don't take my check card. I'm going right into town. I hope that's not too bad of an idea. It's discount foods, so that's 0.7 miles away. something. Rio Fernando. Okay, 0.5 miles. Taos Pueblo. Deliberately fit. Unicorn School Supplies. Okay, I take a left on Camino de la Placita. Johnny's Barbershop. So it's uh, police have uh, had to visit somebody. It's two cop cars. There's McDonald's. Mmm. Indian Hills Inn, Big Five. Oh, this is, yeah, there's a Smith's. Okay, the Smith's isn't, Smith's isn't too far from the library. It's just I only have like $30 on my food stamps. And they don't take my, they won't take my credit card. I think I have 30 on the... I can get one... I can get some good stuff. One time. Okay, Camino. This might be it. There's a third police car. So they're, they're really huddling around this area. La Placita. So this is my left. Harwood Museums to the left. Yeah, I gotta take it easy around here. There's a lot going on. Oh my god, you couldn't make it, huh? Wow. That's unfortunate. It's 
some guy strutting across the street. So I think I'll check. I think I think I'll immediately go to the grocery store rather than settle down on my laptop. I'd like I'd like to have some food ready. I, I overeat though. That's the thing. But man, a burger would be very, oh man. A burger would be very nice before I settle down on the computer. Have a burger and then go at it. That'd be very nice. I think I see tourists walking. Is the library in the middle of a tourist section? Oh, there's parking meters. Oh no. I guess I should have bicycled to the library. I didn't realize it'd be like a downtown Santa Fe situation. <laughs> I'm gonna be struggling to find a place to, to park then. Oh, there's our parking meters in the parking lot. Taos Plaza. Yeah, the, the grocery store is a good distance. Municipal school, fire truck, wrong way, so they got one ways. 25 through here, stop sign. Oh my God, it's right here then. Municipal court, oh no. It's next to the municipal court, next to like a hospital. Okay, library's to the left. Oh no, there's nobody parked there. Town of Taos, town hall. There's nobody parked in that, in that lot. I'm gonna turn in here. I don't think this is it. Oh! 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 Jesus! Okay, yeah, there's resident parking only signs. And it's not gonna let you drive through, I'm sure. Yeah, it's. So I gotta turn around. I gotta go right back the way I came in, over that nasty bump, and turn into the town hall, which is closed. The GPS is doesn't know what to think of this. Why would the town hall be so empty? There's no, there's a. Uh, Obviously no library. There's no there's nothing going on today. Probably be because of Easter. Didn't I just I don't recall. Oh Jesus. So it's all city offices are closed today, I think. I still didn't see any reference to the uh, the library. Oh. Uh, uh, maybe it's okay, but they're closed too. Is it because of uh, Easter? Well, I might as well just park on the end here and. Yeah, somebody, I think, is sitting in their car. The only ca other car in the library lot. Jeez. Some little chipmunk. It's hidden too well.
<laughs> One more time. I don't understand why they have adults and children, ours, separate. This is the first time I've seen a library do that. It just amazes me. There's so many things that other people would do that I would never do. It's just strange. There's this guy who put up this sign. He took like 10 minutes to put it up and write on it. To like, He put it up blank. And not a single car drove by in that whole time. Time. SRAM parking. That's weird. What's SRAM? I don't know if that's readable. Looks like it's some kind of a border collie. They said that the, the turkeys were a real useful thing to them. That's pretty neat. Already these two uh, descriptions are making fun of the Spanish. Right, according to this, the Spanish got back their painting, but then it was lost again. <laughs> okay. Ashram parking here. One vehicle. Maybe it's for tonight? Seems a little excessive to have these thick walls. I guess if there was a big uh, Pueblo revolt, then this would be an honor. Oh, all right. <laughs> oh, me without my GPS. I need that. never seen somebody drive around with a license plate on their car backwards so the back is facing out somebody did that for the front part of their car not the back though all right I think this is a hotel I'm gonna take a quick peek in here. I don't think this is the, the museum, but it's open. Oh, hey, is there a museum or is this it or no? Are you looking for Harwood? Uh, yeah, yeah, I think that's the one. Oh, the Harwood's down the road. Oh, okay. What's this open for? For a gallery. Okay, so you're just selling things and that's, yeah. okay, presenting them in a way that looks like a museum. I guess. <laughs> we have old things, so they look like that, yes. Okay. Huh. <clears throat> yeah. Alright, I'll just look and I'll leave. Sure, leave don't worry. Yeah, if you're looking for hardwood, just uh, keep going now. It's probably closed today, right? Um.
So I just casually turned down Ranchitos, <laughs> which uh, was taking me further and further away from any any destination I was looking for. I want to look for McDonald's. I think it's down La Placenta. It's kind of busy on a Friday. Ladue Street. Museums. Yeah, this is... They're trying to be like Santa Fe. Not getting the not getting the numbers, though. Not allowed to give out any information that way. Oh, did, oh, I have to catch them, you see? You can't tell me his hours. No. Right, okay. He doesn't have hours. He comes in and out yeah. of the store throughout the day. Yeah, I know that Walmart says that, you know, I asked about hours for somebody and they said yeah, that. Well, they can't give out he hours. He doesn't work here. He just comes in and out yeah. throughout the day. But I'm not asking, like... Uh, for his hours, I was asking contact information. You're saying there's that's not even no. a, that's not even a, in no. existence. That's his personal information, no? Yeah. All right. Why would you even refer to him then? You're the one that told me. What? Who can I talk to about? I said we just don't have one. We yeah, don't okay. Have I asked it. you who could I refer to. You said this guy, but he has no contact no, I information. No, this guy. I'm not gonna argue with that about well, it. Well, it's just ridiculous. We just don't have it. Yeah, you don't have any any person in res who's responsible over this. No. Who a person can no. contact. No. But you talk about him, you refer no. to him, but he's not responsible, right? I'm not gonna argue. Yeah, yeah, that's sir. ridiculous. Yeah. Some McDonald's uh, attack the, the parkers, 30 minute parking, and other Walmart McDonald's will attack the people inside and say 30 minutes no loitering. You could attack both, I guess, for uh, a nice overall um, regulation. There are some gangbangers here, but it's not so obvious. Cop is following one. <laughs> Oh, they've already parked. He was just, he looked like he was really watching them. He didn't even, when he drove by me, he didn't even look at me. This is interesting. Indian Hills Inn is out of business. Pay two third night free from 149. That's their last advertisement. Interesting. Oh, there's a no trespassing. They've boarded up every single window. What happened? The pool still has a little water in it. They boarded up everything back here. Ew. There might be a dead animal in there. It's uh, come down. It's got some flotation things. What happened? This looked like a pretty nice setup. Broken window up there. Looks like no trespassing. Huh. They boarded up every window except for on the second story. People can climb up there too. People are breaking the windows up. And I hear a, an alarm. This was a very nice place. And then they had to board up everything. Was this a, uh, yeah, they, but the people here, looks like they've broken every top window, every single window just to be jerks. This area is a little concerning. There's that, uh, that crayon smell again. I still haven't figured out what the source of that is, but it's, oh, you can go upstairs on the, on the stairs. I kind of want to check that out. They didn't break these windows. Maybe because there's... Oh, they broke one. This are, it's all boarded up over there, too. Broken windows. Yeah, I guess it is kind of old looking. Locks little too much traffic. I guess it is kind of old looking. Looks like the same owners of this Indian hotel. I should look in the front windows. They probably have those open. No, they actually, they boarded those. I think they may also own this building here. 
Maybe this is a, a case of bad management. No trespassing. Makes me curious. Right, well, I was hoping to pass through behind, but it doesn't look... Uh, it might be possible if I really check close. I was uh, originally going to the laundromat, and I still will. I just... I find this fascinating that they got such a uh, abandoned building that really looks like it could have gotten uh, fixed up with all the traffic there is and they had to go out of business for something like this this is very nice that must be a clear case of a bad management issue maybe google maps has some reviews if it still exists Smith's is just across the street and their days are numbered because they're going to war Go, they're starting a war that they can't win against the bank. Oh my god So it's called Indian Hills Inn and what's really strange is they did not take down the, the name of the, the business a lot of smart business owners will immediately take down all signs these guys failed. They failed on several fronts. So there's this guy who dropped off his food at the laundromat because <clears throat> he didn't didn't want it to go to waste. So the Indian Hills Inn is over there. <laughs> I was thinking maybe I could sleep under here, but they put a fence all the way around. People were sleeping under here next to the grocery store. Here's another church that charges for parking. 